First behind the line. In three, two, one, go. And firing quickly, Apophis for that Red Alliance. Shots already up in the air. One, two, and three. Good by Apophis. Trying to line up one, two, three, four, and shots all by the bomb squad. Backing up some more power cells. And shots back up in the air. And it's going to be the Blue Alliance with a single point advantage. No, 11 point advantage when autonomous mode ends. Looks like problems right now for 59-65 as the power struck girls robots not yet moved off the initialization line. The bomb squad, one, two, three, and four, quickly up and through. On the other side of the field, Apophis, one, two, three, quickly up and through for red. All those power cells going to the upper power ports right now. Bomb squad in position for more. One, two, three, up, four, up, one in. Now they get a second one up and in from close range. Up close and personal right now, the Bomb Squad, one, two, and three, up and in. Team 16, the Blue Alliance starting to pull ahead. Apophis trying to even the match on the other side of the field. Currently ranked number seven for Apophis. They put four shots up, three shots went through. Still problems for the Power Strike girls as that robot has not yet moved from that initialization line. Bomb Squad, three out of four, once again to the upper power port. Those power cells flying quickly through the air from the shooter for Apophis and the Bomb Squad. Apophis now getting ready to fire again, playing some defense, 78-46. Apophis is gonna try to out-muscle them. Oh, that's gonna be in position to score, but now to the outside of the contact. Some great defense being played by the Zombie Squad. In position just a little bit early for that Blue Alliance. Bomb Squad putting some shots up and in. And it is Time Bluff High School Robotics team grabbing a hold of the switch just a little bit early. Shots up and in as the end game begins. Power Struck Girls Robot is underway, making contact in their protected zone. Apophis trying to get ready to hang. They can get themselves a level switch for red. The Bomb Squad in the air. Pine Bluff in the air. Trying to park inside their foundation with time running out. Not going to be a level hang. But it does look like two robots in the air for blue and a level switch for red. Time expires on the match. We'll turn this over to our refs. It's going to be 97 for red, 166 for blue. The bomb squad moves up to ranking number one. 33 penalty points didn't make a difference in the outcome, but that 65-point endgame sure did. 15 points awarded to the red, four penalty points, 33 for blue.